Hi guys, it is a spectacularly gorgeous, over the top beautiful day. Here in the end times in paradise, it is a Saturday, September 16th. <laughs> so anyway guys, uh, the summer of 2023, as I thought was not a good year for my tomatoes, I put... 12 tomato plants out here on Memorial Day. I came and set these little uh, 12 plants out, pretty much walked away and have not been back. Well, I come out here, you know, for my one BLT tomato each day. And then I took off to New York, baby, for a couple of days. <laughs> I came over here yesterday with a little bag and filled up, a, I guess, a five-gallon bag of these tomatoes in about five minutes. Uh, good Lord, I am guessing I have 30 gallons of tomatoes. Uh, <laughs> I mean, look, look at this. Here is five tomatoes. I mean, look at that beauty. You know, just doesn't get any better than that. Man. Oh, Lord. <laughs> 30 gallons of salsa. So, uh, <laughs> anybody wants 20 gallons of salsa come see me at Bugs in a Jar Farm where uh, <laughs> we have the salsa good lord look it I mean this one this is this is one stem weighs Good Lord, 10 pounds. I mean, look at these. He doesn't, he's not quite ready to let go. He wants one more day. Oh, man. Get out there and harvest your tomatoes. Well, you just, well, you still can. It is September... 16th, you know, the tomatoes are about a a month late with this cold wet winter. I mean, look at that beauty. Oh, he's hanging on too. Good lord. <laughs> it is a bountiful universe. Whatever let it be said, it's not a bountiful universe. <laughs> I mean, guys, I did no work on these tomatoes. I, I stuck them in the ground and walked away and came back in three months. And then, of course, I don't know where my potatoes... Uh, let's... We'll see if we can. I don't even know if I want to know. You know, look at that. Probably got 300 pounds of these beautiful organic homegrown potatoes. Talk about sticking in the ground sticking stuff in the ground. I, I spent, between these tomatoes and these potatoes, uh, if I spent an hour, uh, <laughs> man, Lord, probably around 10 or $12 and about an hour of work, uh, Easily 300 pounds of 
tomatoes. I would say closer to probably 500 pounds of tomatoes. I'm guessing, who knows, 300 pounds of potatoes for less than $15 in an hour of work. And, uh, the world is hungry. I mean, you know, guys, it's not that hard. I just, uh, I'm just thinking of the 200, 300 pounds of these absolutely gorgeous homegrown, vine ripened, organic tomatoes uh, going in the damn dump. If anybody around Ithaca, New York, uh, Basil, I can't imagine you need any of these. Jeremy, I don't know if you need, good Lord, anybody anywhere near Ithaca, New York looking for tomatoes, come see me at Bugs in a Jar Farm. Sandy, do you need 200 more pounds of tomatoes? <laughs> All right. I am off to make salsa while I still can. Uh, I'm getting ready to put in a, uh, a double line of, uh, of Joe Pie weed. And out here digging 40 holes. So this will be the new line of Joe Pie weed. You know, I could just plant tomatoes right here. This could be a, just a, right here, I could plant 40 tomato plants. Right here in this one, so I could plant 40 tomato plants and get a ton, a ton of tomatoes off of that one line. All right. Let me, uh, boy. I guess the Robin family. I think they had, did they have three sets of babies this year? Oh, man. <laughs> Here's what I picked yesterday. Fine looking mater. Bye, guys. <laughs>